Hi, it's Dave Robinson with PlantCoverCrops.com and a uh, test plot in a cover crop test plot in northeastern Indiana. It's March 16th and we're in a field of what was Austrian winter peas and radishes and I uh, just want to pan down here and look at what this radish looks like uh, that had been last fall, had been nice and, and tall. Still have some green in the bottom of this leaf or at least a little bit of a green tint there, still have some good nutrients. My hole here is uh, about uh, four inches deep or three inches deep and about an inch across and uh, lots of little uh, dead radishes out here with lots of residue and so forth. And also we have Austrian winter peas that have lived through the winter. And uh, that is uh, kind of exciting again and the fact that we're still producing nitrogen from these Austrian winter peas. This was planted last fall and um, not terribly uh, early, but uh, we've got some good root mass in here. It'll be interesting to see if we can find any nodules. The ground is uh, relatively moist and um, the peas are nice and green. I think that we uh, hopefully, uh, well, it's going to be really hard to keep a nodule um, to make it with this soil being this moist, uh, being able to get a, a nodule uh, to look at. But nevertheless, we've got some nitrogen production going on. We've got root mass in the soil. We've got an earthworm right here, right that was in the root root zone, and uh, just what we. Well, in fact, a couple earthworms here, and that's what we want. We want to have that. In fact, can't see it very well probably, but there are some nodules on uh, from some peas that are right here um, in the soil at the end of my uh, finger. So we're producing nitrogen. We're, we're scavenging nitrogen with the radishes, um, and on March 16th, we're still. Uh, still have some good nitrogen production going on. As you pan out through here, you don't see a whole lot of green, so it's not like you're, we're providing uh, uh, consistent nitrogen throughout the whole plot, but nevertheless, in our soil, we're building that nitrogen, building organic matter, and you can see the residue that's out here as well. Again, Dave Robinson, PlantCoverCrops.com, and a cover crop test plot on um, March 16th, 2012.